Did you know? Each year, more than 23 million U.S. men get PSA screenings for prostate cancer. One million undergo prostate biopsies. 250,000 are diagnosed with prostate cancer. Half of new cases are low risk, unlikely to spread or become life-threatening. Yet 90% will receive immediate treatment with surgery or radiation, despite only a 3% chance of the disease progressing or becoming deadly. A man has to make many decisions, and all of them affect his life. If he's diagnosed with prostate cancer, he faces a really tough one. Some prostate cancers are high risk, aggressive, and more likely to spread. Others are low risk, least likely to have bad outcomes. The biopsy says cancer, but current diagnostic tools provide limited information about how aggressive a man's individual disease is. So most men decide to treat prostate cancer immediately. Once treated, many men experience serious long-term side effects, like incontinence and sexual impotence. Immediate treatment isn't always needed, but right now a man can't be sure if his cancer is the kind that is likely to require treatment or if he's okay to wait for now. What if there was a test that could determine how aggressive prostate cancer is? Genomic Health is developing a new test to do just that. By reviewing the underlying biology of the tumor and using genes from multiple biologic pathways, the test can predict the aggressiveness of prostate cancer when diagnosed, allowing a man to make a more informed treatment decision with confidence taking care of himself with more information and greater peace of mind.